Shia LaBeouf's Hollywood Journey, and Indiana Jones 5. Hollywood can be a pendulum, and few know this better than Shia LaBeouf. Let's roll back to the late 2000s. Shia was on top of the world. He was fresh off Transformers, oozing potential and charisma, and it seemed like Spielberg himself had anointed him as the next big thing with Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. Shia was set up to inherit the whip and the hat. But the thing about Hollywood is it's not just about your last hit. It's about momentum and image. In the years that followed, Shia took a detour from mainstream blockbuster cinema and embraced a more eclectic path. Some call it performance art. Some call it a public breakdown. There were arrests, there were controversies, there were paper bags over his head declaring he wasn't famous anymore. And all that can be quite the cocktail for industry decision makers. The perception of reliability is key in a business where hundreds of millions are on the line. Shia's public behavior began to cast doubt on that reliability, and then came the allegations of abuse in recent years, which, if you've been paying any attention to Hollywood's current ethos, is akin to kryptonite. Cut to Indiana Jones 5. Spielberg steps down, James Mangold steps in, and the industry is in a different space. It's a space very conscious of public image and the stories behind the scenes. Even if Shia is on a path to recovery and redemption, which for his own sake I hope he is, the studio likely sees too much risk in rolling the dice on his involvement. So in Portland, I used to go see these big blockbusters at the historical Hollywood theater. You can feel the history on the walls, and it's a great place to catch a flick. But even the Hollywood theater can't hide the fact that the audience's taste and Hollywood's patience with certain behavior have changed. And change in Hollywood is both hard-won and swift to cut ties when the winds veer. Indiana Jones is an iconic franchise, and it has to sail smoothly. Studio execs probably didn't want to navigate the choppy waters that sometimes follow actors like Shia. Shia being cast out? It's a cocktail of past behavior, industry direction, and the inexorable change of public and studio appetites. Fame is fickle, and as always, the house wins. It's an old tale, oft repeated under the bright lights of Hollywood.